Hi, I'm Rachel Greninger with Red Carpet Report, and tonight we're at the 2016 Final Draft Awards talking to writers about writing. Are on point. <laughs> you look at my purse. Hey. It's the jam. It's the same color. <laughs> Please. Uh, can we? Yes. Can we just trade? Yeah, that for this. I literally was like, she looks like something I would wear, and so you're like my style twin. And you wrote Pitch Perfect. Thank you. And Pitch and Perfect too. One. And I'm writing the third one right now. Right now? Yeah. You, you're yeah. doing it I amazingly. Break. I took a break I to put talk. makeup on, get my hair done, put a dress on, some heels. Uh, yeah. So, um, were you, um, well, I guess, were you a choir kid in school? Like, where did the inspiration for Pitch Perfect come from? I was a choir kid, but I was also an athlete, so I I ran that. Like, the line? <laughs> barely? I barely. Don't tell anybody, because you was, just lost all your choir run, kid. Like, oh. Um, like, project <laughs> onto the field. <laughs> Shoot a basket and then, and then be really excited about it. Um, yeah, but I, I the idea came from, like, uh, I, I just heard about that world and thought it was so rich and right. funny and interesting and I had never ripe, ripe it was ripe for the taking and it was I, and, and I, you I did I it three it. times <laughs> well two and a half two. we're working on the third <laughs> yeah. taking a break right now the, on the third, third. me I'm sure it's no, gonna be kidding. dope I, I hope so of I course it so. is you're writing it the we other two are amazing great fans that love it and um so they love it so much I'm kind of like it takes a little bit of the pressure off this go round because they were so present for the second one <laughs> so, can, so can I tell you a funny story yes. uh, my uh, ex-boyfriend is a like six foot like huge yokes not a douchebag okay, oh, okay. How real talk long, how long did you date this guy <laughs> too long <laughs> but the funny thing about it he loves pitch perfect loves it he well, I remember him calling me because he should because it's it's it should touch every human being's heart so this it, right here is the endorsement of even strong men need to love pitch perfect yes. he loves the musical portion he really does well that's awesome because and I love it too music uh, makes everybody feel good you know, it really does. It's, it's uh, memories. We have memories. Of, I'm sure you hear a song and you're like, I what was if I said in no. seventh grade. What if I was like, that's <laughs> never happened. <laughs> no. Can't say that. Can't say that. <laughs> Edit that out. Yeah. Just kidding. We're joking. It's no, fine. No. So um, tell me a little bit about uh, what you're looking forward to seeing um, sort of manifest in the Pitch Perfect world for the next couple of years. Oh, for the next couple of years? Well, I'm, I'm really looking forward to like kind of um, telling a whole story of like life after college you know like what that what does that mean relevant stuff <laughs> yeah like or you know just like sort of see them in their in a real world situation which I think is fun and like just to see well that's hilarious grow. well uh, I mean hopefully you know Absolutely. and then also that idea when you leave college are you friends with the people that you were friends with and you know you are you are you um, I am Facebook friends. So kind of. Kind of. But, but only because I live so far away. Like, in my heart and mind, they are... Well, that is a really good um, distinction for all her Facebook friends <laughs> that are now like, we're friends. No, we're really friends. But I love them so much. You know, I do of have course. all those memories. Well, stuff. I'm not from yeah. here either. So for me, it's like you move and then you're like, we're autonomously still love each other because we are on the same path. Right. But, right. But high five from a distance. Like in my mind, I always think it's been six months since I've last seen them, but it's actually been 15 years. You know, like <laughs> it's been like a really you long time. <laughs> <laughs> Cut that out. Cut that out. Cut that out right now. Don't put that in there. <laughs> oh my God. Thank you so much. You were the most thank exciting you. thing I've ever done. <laughs> like ever just done. That's really creepy. But no, but thank, thank you. you. So nice to meet everything. you, Nate. Thanks for watching, and if you like what you've seen here, hit like, subscribe, and in the comments below, tell me who your favorite writer is.